Hi, this is Julian March with the Star News. We're about to take a trip up I-40. Come on with us and look at the attractions along the way. Seven miles of I-40 is dedicated in honor of Michael Jordan. The NC Board of Transportation voted to dedicate the stretch in honor of Jordan in 1991. The NBA star graduated from New Hanover County's Laney High School. In September of 1991, Jordan was moved to tears at a ceremony unveiling the marker. At the Pender and New Hanover County line, the I-40 bridge passes over the waters of the Northeast Cape Fear River. The river snakes 130 miles through eastern North Carolina. The river joins the Cape Fear River just north of downtown Wilmington. We're here off I-40 at Lake Lehman in Duplin County. This lake was originally farmland, named after one of the early owners of the property. His first name was Lehman. As I-40 was being constructed, the DOT came through here and cut out all of the sand to use to build up the roadway. Uh, since then, it's become a recreational lake. There's RV sites, uh, tent camping sites. We're here along I-40 in the Watha area of Pender County. Behind me is at one of nine wildflower beds the NCDOT maintains along I-40 between New Hanover County and the Sampson and Johnston County line. This is an unusual site. We're a few miles off I-40 in Rose Hill, still in Duplin County. Behind me is what's called the world's largest frying pan. It has a capacity of 365 chickens. And if you want to know, that takes 200 gallons of cooking oil to heat all those chickens up and cook them. The pan itself weighs two tons, and the maximum number of meals they've served here is 3,000. The world's largest frying pan was actually built in recognition of Duplin County's burgeoning poultry industry, and it's still used today for community events for fundraising. A mile 364, about 45 miles outside Wilmington in the Warsaw area of Duplin County, is the first rest stop on I-40 if you're leaving Wilmington. It's your last chance to use the bathroom at a state rest area for 40 miles. The rest area and visitor center opened in 1990. It has space for 47 cars, 11 trailers, and 10 trucks. If you ask a staff member nicely, you can get a free highway map of North Carolina.